Hey, hi guys, welcome to PCF. This is the continuation of uh, data warehouse tutorial. So yesterday I have we have discussed about the what is data warehouse and I'll have given very simple examples. Okay, if you haven't watched that video, so I strongly recommend to watch that video guys, okay? So today in this topic, we are going to discuss what is data mart in a data warehouse, okay? So data mart is a part of data warehouse guys, okay? So, or you can say, it's a subset of a data warehouse also. A data mart is mainly focused on a single subject like uh, sales, finance, HR, etc. And also it's oriented on specific business. Okay, let's see in diagram. So like what is, uh, you know, data mart. Okay, let's go here. So, so this is a operational. Okay, these are the operational database like HR, sales and finance. And then, uh, so they integrated like so they integrated with the etl operations like uh, so we have a etl so like it will extract the uh, you know, data and then transform like so that may be you know comma separated nulls and if if it is not a clean data so so the etl operations will uh, you know transform the data and then load it to the data warehouse okay so again the data marts are created for hr and sales and finance so you may you, you may have the doubts like so again here we have in the source level we have hr and finance and uh, uh, sales again we are also creating the data marts so these are the day to day operations case okay? these are the operational databases so the source are operational databases these are the historical data data marts also kind of historical data specific to the subject actually so these 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 it will not so whatever the source uh, hr sales and finance there so those are the you know day to day activities it will not have so if you want to analyze something then uh, so we'll go and then we'll create the data marts so question here like we have a data warehouse even though why we required a data marts right so so people may have that question okay so what is the need of uh, you know data mart data mart is like suppose uh, hr manager is there so you want to only analyze the hr data you don't want the sales and finance and then sales manager is there you want to only analyze the sales data so it's focused on only single subject case so it's focused on single subject specific to the person so to create a department wise reports to create department wise report we'll go for the data marts so data warehouse is for the organizational wise reports okay if you da data warehouse is for the organization uh, so for organization wise reports we'll go for the data warehouse but department wise reports if you want to create a department wise reports so you can go for the data mart so data mart we have a you know two types of approaches like we can create a two ways so first uh, so top down approach what is this top down approach so we have uh, like we are taking the different different application data and then we are applying the transformations uh, sorry we are applying the transformations and then uh, we are loading into the data warehouse and after creating a data warehouse we can create the uh, data marts okay this is the top down approach first we'll create in the data warehouse and then we are creating the data marts okay so this is top down approach so what is bottom uh, bottom up approach means so bottom up approach so it is also taking the different different application data and then staging area it will do the etl operations and then it will create the data marts first so bottom up approach means first data marts will be created and then data data warehouse will be created so we have two types of approaches so this is about the data mart guys okay if you have any questions you can post in the comments below so that i can you know uh, give an answers case okay so hope you understand what is data mart so data mart is a single uh, you know single subject uh, or uh, it focused on mainly on single subject or uh, specific business okay for that purpose okay hr people want to analyze hr data only finance people analyze finance data only so like sales manager want to analyze sales data only then we'll go for the data parts hope you understand uh, hope you like the video okay please uh, uh, share and subscribe if you watch uh, first time my channel okay please subscribe my channel for more videos case okay thank you so much uh, have a great day guys thank you